Hey there, in this video, I'm gonna be talking about how you can automate your follow-up emails in Go High Level. My name's Brad Smith, owner of Automation Links. I've been doing this marketing stuff for a long time. In today's video, I'm gonna teach you how to do it if you wanna follow up with your leads using email. Now we like Go High Level because it saves us time, it saves us money, and it's the best CRM software for our business, and we usually recommend it to our clients. But really, depending on what you use, whether it's HubSpot, ActiveCampaign, or maybe nothing at all, you can automate your emails so your new leads never forget about you. So in today's video, let's jump into it. Four simple tips to setting up automation emails in your high-level account. Tip number one, navigate over to the Automate tab. You're going to see automation there. Click on that, open up the new automation there, and go in and create a brand new one. Once you create a new automation, you can set your trigger. I usually wait to set my trigger until I start building those automations. Tip number two, go ahead and set a name for this. For me today in this video, I'm showing you our newsletter. So I call it newsletter there, and I'm gonna have a delay step there because after someone joins my newsletter, we're gonna have a delay where we're gonna wait and send it to them every Sunday at 5 p.m. Now, you can also set up an automated email that goes out after somebody builds out that form on your website to welcome them. Say, hey, thanks for joining. So in this example here, I'm showing that they sign up for my newsletter, and I'm going to send them a welcome email. And then I'm going to have a delay until 5 p.m. on Sunday when I send them that first email. So that's really what you want to do is how does this going to start? How are those emails going to go? And then we'll go ahead and build it from there. And always go make sure that you name it properly. So when you come back, it's easy to find because hopefully you set up multiple automations to keep following up with your leads. Tip number three, set up triggers. So let's say they schedule with you. So if somebody's coming in to a lead form on your website, they fill out the form, they get some automated welcome emails from you. Why don't we send them down another funnel if they schedule? Because we want to make those specific to the schedule. So if they don't schedule with you, they can keep receiving your automated follow-up emails that you're building relationships with. But if they do schedule, let's put them in a schedule automation where we say, hey, thanks for scheduling. And then here's a reminder for your schedule. And then you want to send them a reminder email after they schedule, thanking them with the next call to action. Tip number four, what happens after they go through the automation funnel? So they opt in from your website to something. They get a welcome email from you. You have some triggers if they schedule, if they buy, different things like that, maybe even abandoned carts. But maybe they get to the end of this automation flow. Now what? I like to add them to a newsletter automation. So then I go create a second automation. We call it newsletter, where we can continue staying top of mind, building relationships through newsletter style emails. That way you just don't stop emailing them. Not everyone's ready to buy today, tomorrow, next week, or next month. Maybe they'll come back and buy in six months or 12 months from now because you continue sending them newsletters. All right, so I want you to think about this for your business. Are you following up with all your leads? And if so, you should follow up with them 21 times or more. Just like I said before, they're not always ready to buy right away. So build relationships with these emails, follow up with them, make them as personal as possible. And if you want my free follow-up blueprint, go ahead and comment new or blueprint down below and we'll get that sent over to you so you can learn how to follow up with your leads, not just in email, but through social media, through videos, and all kinds of different ways. Thanks again for watching the video and I will see you on the next one.